Hello everyone. So today we've got Fanatec gaming controller that came in for a broken USB-C port. Uh, unfortunately last week when it came in I didn't film taking it apart and removing the USB port. I've got the USB port um, delivered now and uh, just gonna take it apart and uh, let me show you on the board. Uh, what stage we're at now? Okay, this is the stage we're at. Got uh, the port there removed. Board is uh, cleaned up and uh, ready to for the new port. Don't know if I'm gonna do it. Um, If I'm gonna flow it uh, from underneath or just do it uh, pin by pin, let's switch to the microscope and uh, we'll see which one is better. Let's focus that. Take this plastic off. This, this side will be a bit more tricky. Yeah, the reason I would like to solder it pin by pin is because, as you see, I put captain tape when I removed it, but there's loads of stuff on the back. You know, like uh, let's try to do it with a soldering iron. See, that's a problem. I've got that. Never mind. We'll get a board holder. Let me switch to the overhead camera. Now I've got bigger metal. Um, this should be holding. Okay. Right. Let's go back to the microscope. Okay. Let's start with the side. Actually, I'm going to try. I'm going to start with the inside bit. More difficult one. Let's get the micro pencil going. Okay. Alexa, turn the extractor on. Okay.
let's do the other side quickly and then we're gonna put it all together don't need this anymore make sure there's no components stuck on it from a previous desoldering okay looks all clean There we go. Alexa, turn the extractor on. Okay. Because it's not an original port, the Chinese ones are on Alibaba. You need to buy a big, big quantity, otherwise they will supply it to you. I had to get a Molex one. The only thing that I was uh, worried about was height of it. That might not be the same. It looks, looks okay. Yeah. Let's put it back together, see if it connects to the computer. I don't have any software installed for it. So I'm just going to check the USB connection. If it connects, it shows up on the devices. See that this is a success. OK, Alexa, turn the extractor off. OK. Just in case you were wondering about the height, it seems to be perfectly fine. So, yeah, don't worry about the height. You can use the Molex connector and it's all good. I don't know if you can see. There you go.
well hopefully you enjoyed the video and i'll see you on the next one